Hi everyone, this is Dara. It's really nice to meet all of you if we've not met before. I'm one of the advisors here and today I'm going to be talking to you about forgiveness as I feel like it's a really important subject to um, bring to surface. So I find that there's a lot of misconception with forgiveness. Um, we primarily unite this delusion by connecting the action of forgiving with the action of pardoning. We connect the action of forgiving with being submissive or passive towards a situation. Being unforgiving is almost seen as a protection mechanism. By holding on to this resentment and anger, I find it's used as a tool to give us strength or empowerment. Um, it makes us feel protected in some way. And we forget that by holding on to these emotions, these bitter emotions, we're actually holding on to the situation and the person that made us feel that way in the first place. And forgiveness is really a beautiful release. It's a release that stems from self-love. And it truly is rare to feel that actually forgiving someone else is simply the action of showing love for ourselves. So it's only natural that when given this opportunity, we shy away from it as self-love is so unknown to us. So when connecting forgiveness with pardoning, we need to acknowledge that there would be no self-love when condoning someone else's unloving behavior, nor would it be self-loving to continue to cling on to the bitterness or the toxic, um, you know, bitterness with, with holding on to this resentment within our body. So we must find a balance um, between the both. So as we start the process to forgive and we shift the committed feeling of blaming the other person to loving ourselves, we begin to naturally unravel these attachments to the people that have hurt us. And we make way for many new opportunities in our lives. And we, we bring in healthy relationships. Um, we allow new healthy relationships to form around us. We heal old relationships in our lives and we bring freedom into our lives. So, you know, we, we bring this freedom that we never really truly felt could exist. So um, this is sort of the message that I wanted to share with you and I hope it resonated and that's all that I have for now. So I'm sending you love and healing and um, if you want to get in touch, please don't hesitate to book a reading with me. I'll speak to you soon. Bye for now.